Every year, our men and women in uniform battle it out for bragging rights and to raise money for some important community organizations in the Guns and Hoses baseball game. And here to tell us more about it and how you can be a part of it is the team captain from the fire department, the Las Vegas Fire and Rescue, yes, Edgar correct. Hernandez. Hello. Where is, um, where's the man in blue? Um, you know, I tried contacting them and I tried Googling the, the nearest donut shop. <laughs> I don't know if they're maybe just maybe hanging he's, out. He has a video. Maybe he, he's wow. not done with his uh, <laughs> his dozen donuts. I don't know. We're already um, talking smack here. <laughs> I, you know, I, <laughs> fire wins already. It's it's yeah. guns and hoses. This is such a fun event. You guys yes. take it very seriously. We obviously. take it pretty seriously. Um, I think mainly because a lot of the um, the guys on the team have played in the past. Yeah. Um, we grew up playing ball. Um, some actually played pro ball, oh, wow. semi pro. Um, so it never. It never went away. We enjoy the game. We take it seriously. We want to have fun, but we do take it seriously, and we just enjoy doing it. Now, who won last year? We won last year. Fire won. We okay. Won the year before. And and the, oh, so have. Yeah, we're kind of on a winning streak right now. Wow, you're winning yeah, right here. So, I'll tell you that much. Are you guys yeah. practicing a lot? How do you prepare for we, something like this? We try to start about at least a month out, maybe a month and a half uh -huh. out, and um, we'll do about a practice a week. If we can squeeze in two, we will. Um, and a lot of it, you know, just comes back to you, like riding a bike, you know. Um, like I said, some, some of the guys still play on a weekend league, adult league, and so it never left. Uh, but that love for the game, still there. How often uh, do you see the community come together for such an amazing event like this? I mean, you guys are really benefiting a lot of great organizations. We are. Uh, just to name a few, well, our organization, the uh, Firefighters Benefit Association, um, which helps out active and retired firefighters and their families. Um, the cops are playing for the Latino Police Officers Association. Um, we also have Make-A-Wish, uh, MDA, uh, Derek England's hometown heroes. Um, he's actually going to be our honorary GM oh, for the game oh, for, on, our, on the, the fire, fire side. side. On the fire oh, side. very yeah. cool. Um, and so I think it, it just it's it's really good for the community, I, especially playing at the new ballpark. I think people will enjoy being there, watching the game, and and helping out. It's very exciting that it's going to be at such an amazing yes. place. If you haven't yes. seen the Las Vegas ballpark, it's that's going to be exciting for it you is. to be on the field over it there. It is. Huh? You know, we played at Cashman in the past, and um, it was still an honor to yeah. play on a professional field. And now that we're going to be playing at the ballpark, which was rated number one in AAA yep. as the best ballpark, um, playing the inaugural year of the Aviators and for or on a field of a team that is in first place at this time, it's just going to be it's going to be amazing it, and it's going to be a lot of fun. It's gonna, a it's fun. a great community yes. event. Like you said, Derek England's going to be there. Yes. I think we're going to have to go for the boys in red. What do you think? I, oh. Yeah, sure. Why not? <laughs> You'll take it. Why not? Again, it is the Guns and Hoses <laughs> baseball game in partnership with the Las Vegas Metropolitan Police Department and the Las Vegas Fire and Rescue this Sunday at the Las Vegas Ballpark. Doors open at 5 p.m. You guys are going to have fun. We're going to have uh, family, um, fun, friend, family fun events before. Okay. Uh, we'll have uh, fire trucks, fire engines, police vehicles, SWATs. Um, we will have our clown car. Um, and. I believe the aviators mascot will be there. It's going to be so um, much fun. Yeah, and we're actually going to be raffling off this uh, catcher's mitt that was signed by the aviators team, all the team members. We'll be doing $5 raffle tickets, and it will be... Uh, raffled off or the winner will be chosen during seventh inning stretch. That sounds great. It's yeah. happening this Sunday. Get your t uh, tickets at the Aviators Ballpark or through Ticketmaster.com. Lindsay, 